hi lovelies welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be sharing with you the best way you can preserve or store your peanut to avoid the uh, spoilage or to avoid germinating so hobby just got back from the store and he bought this bag of peanut i'm a very big fan of peanut like whether roasted fried boiled i'm a very big fan of peanut because peanuts are really tasty a very nutritious snack although they are really high in fat but are also packed with lots of proteins so several factors can actually cause uh, spoilage in your peanut so as we move along i will tell you some of the factors that can actually cause your peanut to go bad so without wasting much of our time let's get started so i've already gone ahead to sort the peanut out by sorting out i mean picking out the bad ones out from the good ones I will recommend or I will advise whenever you go to the store to buy or purchase your peanuts, just take your time to sort them or pick them out so that when you are eating or enjoying it, you will not be worried or scared of eating a rotten or a bad peanut. So like I said, several factors can make your peanut to go bad. As you can see, this one has already started uh, germinating. This is because of moist or water. So over here is another one. It has already started growing mud as well. This is just because of contact of moist or water. So heat as well can also make your peanut to go bad. So this is much of what I picked out after I finished uh, sorting them out. And please note, after I finished uh, picking or sorting them, I also went ahead to wash the peanut with uh, vinegar which I did not show on this video because I don't want the video to be too long okay so I'm just going to start by spraying the good ones on my train and did you notice the small hand that is touching that peanut on the tree like did you notice that tiny hand <laughs> Don't mind the second hand you are seeing there. That is my little helper, Derek. So after I finished uh, spraying the peanut on the tray, I brought them outside so that the sun can dry them a little bit this is just to reduce the uh, excess water or excess moist to avoid the uh, germinating spoiling or getting more moss and uh, I bless God the day hobby bought this peanut it was super 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 sunny the day he bought this peanut so when it stayed for some minutes or some hours i will come back and uh, flip it the other way around so that the other side can as well get dried so yeah i'm going to bring it back when it is fully dried so after some minutes of allowing the peanut to sit under the sun because like i said the day hobby bought this peanut it was super super sunny and as you can see the peanuts are really looking so good looking so fresh and they're looking so neat as well you can as well leave yours on the sun depending on how sunny your environment or your weather is okay so at this point i'm going to sprinkle some salt inside the peanut when I'm done sprinkling the salt, I'm going to toast them around so that they can be coated inside the peanut, okay? So the salt will help to prevent the peanut from germinating further. It will also keep them away from a uh, burrow bug. Burrow bug, that is an insect that feeds on our peanut. Just like the way we have a uh, beans wovel that eat our beans, we also have an insect that feed on our peanut. So yeah. Over to my airtight container, you can as well use a bag if you don't have an airtight container and please make sure the container is super 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 neat and they dried as well because you don't want water or moist to come in contact with the peanut likewise the bag if at all you are using bag to store yours okay so i'm just adding the peanut inside the container one at a time and remember like i said heat moist or water can actually make your peanut to go bad or to start germinating so as you can see i still have a space inside the container so if you are adding it do not add it excess or do not add to the brim of the container 
to avoid the peanut or nut from cracking while you are forcing the container to close okay so at this point i'm satisfied with the quantity of peanut that is inside the container i'm just going to close it then i will set it aside here comes another airtight container. I'm just going to open it up and uh, repeat the same process because I still have uh, some peanut left. And please, like I stated earlier, make sure your container or your bag is super, super clean and they're uh, free from moist as well. So at this point, this very one is filled up. I'm going to cover it as well. And here comes the final result of our finished uh, stored or preserved uh, peanut. You can store them in a dark place such as your cabinet or anywhere that you feel that it is conducive for you, okay? And uh, this can stay for 6 to 12 months without germinating or without spoiling. And please don't store them in a wet area or wet environment because when it gets wet, the peanut will start going bad, start getting rotten or even start germinating. If you find this video helpful and informative, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys on my next video. Bye for now.